against slavery, we couldn't do what? Read and write. Right. So who was teaching us? Right. The oppressor was teaching us. Right. Do you think the oppressor going to teach you what you need to know to be above them? Right. The oppressor is not going to tell you that Christ is a black right. man. Right. The oppressor is not going to tell you that Job is a black man. Right. The oppressor is not going to tell you the Jews are black people. Right. The oppressor is not going to tell you the disciples are black. Right. You see what I'm saying? Cause I got sand in my boots and dust in my eyes, but it's okay. As long as they got fear in their eyes and hurt in their soul, then it's okay. And it's okay. Yeah. South Carolina. Blitz. What? As long as I got sand in my boots and dust in my eyes, then I'm okay. So what color again? So why do they lie to us with this? You see what I'm saying? Because whoever controlled the slave mind controlled the slaves. So they put this in your mind, so now you don't have no self-love for yourself no more. Okay. I'm sick of this, okay. The Jews and wickedness. Jews and the wickedness. They ride on their bikes, not ride on a guy, so I'm tired of this wish. Okay, it's not the best. That's supposed to be Jesus, right? It's supposed to be. Right? That's fine. That's fine. We're going to read it for you, all right? Give, give me Revelation 1, verse 1. Check this out, my brother and my sister. Come on. The book of Revelation, chapter 1 and verse 1. The revelation of Jesus Christ. So the Bible said the revelation, the revealing of Jesus Christ. When you're revealing somebody, you're going to show them a description, a picture of who they are. You see what I'm saying, right? Come on. Verse 14. No, no, no. Read, read. The revelation of Jesus Christ, uh -huh. which God gave unto him uh -huh. to show. To do what? To show. To do what? To show. To show. If you're showing somebody something, they got to see it. That's you see right. what I'm saying, right? So now give me verse 10. Come on. Verse 10. Uh -huh. I was in the spirit on the Lord's day. The Lord's day is today, the Sabbath day. That's right. That's the Lord's day. Come on. And heard behind me. So John heard behind him. You turn around. Come on. A great voice uh -huh. as of a trumpet saying, I am Alpha and so, so it's like you're standing here, you heard, come on bro, it's like you're standing here, right? You heard a voice behind you. You're going to turn, right? And the voice, what the voice was saying? I am Alpha and Omega, the first and the last. So that's Christ. He said, I'm Alpha, the Omega, the first and the last, right? Come on. And what thou seest. He said, what you see, what you, what you used to see, your what? Your eye, right? You said what you see, do what? Write in a book. Do what? Write in a book. That's how we got the revelation, the book of Revelation. He said, whatever you see, John, write in the book. So now let's see what John wrote down in the book. Let's make a plain. Give me verse 14. Verse 14. His head. His what? His head. His hair's on top. His hair right here. Come on. And his hair. And the hair's on his face. Come on. 
We're white. What? what? We're white. Like woo. Like woo. Wooly, wooly in touch up. Somebody put that sound up. Lift it up. Lift it up. Yeah, Come on, up. stay alive, brother. Come on. Yeah. See it, right? Read it again. Read that part again. His head uh -huh. and his hair. Come on. We're white. We're what? We're white. Like, what? like woo. Like woo, right. my brothers and my sister. Right. What? What tattoo is that? Right. Woo. Touch my hair, bro. That's woo. I touch right. your hair. That's how it is. That's you right. see what I'm saying? We are the people that have woody hair. Right. That's it, nobody else. Right. That's why we gotta know who we are. Because they be, right. they've been hiding this from us for a long time. Right. That's why black men don't like himself. Right. That's why black women them bleach their hair. Right. No self-esteem, no self-love, because they give us this damn image right here. Right. This image messed us up. Right. And that's why we are here to show you what the real image is. Right. Now right. finish it up, come on. And his eyes were in a flame of fire. And his feet uh -huh. like unto fine bread. This is the most important part. Read it again. It's what? And his feet. It says feet, his feet, his feet. When you go to the feet, it comes complexion. Right. You see what I'm saying? When they look at if I if you take off the socks, I'm gonna see the color. You alright, but you cooperating today. You alright. Read it again, read it again, come on. And his feet. And his what? And his feet. And his feet, your feet, come on. Like unto fine bread. Like unto fine brass. What color is brass, my brother? Come on, bro. What color? What color is brass? You are right. Give me one. Come on. You see that? Brown, right? Come on. As if that brown. John said, as if it was what? They burned in a furnace. See that stuff was so dark, it was looking like it was burning in the furnace. Right. Anything you take, you burn. What color against my brother? Right. My sister, what color again? So why do they lie to us with this? You see what I'm saying? Because whoever controlled the slaves, mind controlled the slaves. So they put this in your mind, so now you don't have no self-love for yourself no more. You see what I'm saying? That's the, you know what I'm saying? What I'm saying? That's why any churches you go, you see this right here. But this is the real deal right here. That's what John said in John 8 and verse 32. Read it for my brothers and my sister real quick. Come on, read that real quick. Let me show you something. Because in slavery, we couldn't do what? Read and write. Right. So who was teaching us? Right. The oppressor was teaching us. Right. Do you think the oppressor going to teach you what you need to know to be above them? Right. The oppressor is not going to tell you that Christ is a black right. man. Right. The oppressor is not going to tell you that Job is a black man. Right. The oppressor is not going to tell you the Jews are black people. Right. The oppressor is not going to tell you the disciples are black. Right. You see what I'm saying? Colored. I don't think y'all know how beautiful your skins are. Right. So let's get color. Drop that. Drop that. Give me, give me, I'll start with the beginning. Ger uh, Genesis. Genesis real quick. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come. Read. The book of Genesis. Check this out, check this out, bro. Check this out. The book of Genesis, chapter 2, and verse 7. And the Lord God formed man of the dust of the ground. So the first man, who was that? The first man. Adam. God formed him from the dust of the ground. The deeper he goes, the what? The darker it gets. So the first man was a black man, my brother. They don't want you to know that. They switched it up on us when we went to, into slavery. That's why when you read Monica during the time of the Renaissance, they introduced this image right here. You see what I'm saying? That's what, now give me Job 30, 30. we won't go to Monica. I should have given it in Maccabees. What is that? Maccabees 4, right? 348, read that real quick. Let me show you something, my brother. How to, how to switch that out. Check this out. Come on. The book of 1 Maccabees, chapter 3 and verse 48. Chapter 3 and verse 48. And laid open the book of the law. So they laid open the book of the law, the Bible, come on. Wherein the heathen, the heathen, the other nation do what? Had sought to paint the likeness of their images. See that? They paint the likeness of their images. That's what they did. And that's how you come about with this. You see the sketches? That's what happened with this. And now, when they, when they did that now, every slave was introduced to this, was taught this. So now, we look at our enemy that brought us over here on Congo Slayship and said they are Jesus. And said they are God chosen people. 
You see what I'm saying? This is what this is what they did to us, my brother. This is what they did to us. They stole this land. They took our people from Africa. Uh, uh, from Africa. They changed their mother tongue. They ripped their men, whipped their women. They oppressed us until this day. And now the black man is just comfortable now. Thinking he, he uh, he's in his heaven. No. Our forefather was brought over here on Congo Slip Ship. Right. Why? Because of our sins. Right. Give me a uh, second mark, give me seven, reverse 32. Let me hit you up with some real quick. Check this out, check this out, check this out. Check that out. Second Maccabees 7, reverse 32. Hey, check this out. Come on. The book of Second Maccabees, chapter 7, and verse 32. Yeah. Yeah. Check this out. Check this out. Come on. For we suffer. The Bible said, for we as a people, black, Hispanics, and Native American, we suffer. Why is that, bro? Because of our sin. See that thing? Read it again. I don't think they hear it. Come on. For we suffer uh -huh. because of our sin. We suffer as a people because of our sins. You see what I'm saying? Because God gave for us his laws. We don't want to keep it. So what he did to us? Bro, 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 I want you to focus, bro. Nothing over there out there for you, bro. I'm telling you straight up. Nothing over there out there for you. Now you good, you good, you good, you with family. So God gave us his laws, right? We didn't keep it. You know what he did? He turned his back on us. And that's why we suffer now. Right. That's why women don't have no value on themselves no more. That's why the women there are talking in the street. Right. Talking on rap videos. Right. Who other nations used to do stuff like that? Only us, bro. Jeez, we have become less as a, as a people. Yeah. Every nation look at us and laugh. Yeah. They never take us seriously because we don't take our yeah. own damn self seriously. Right. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. We all we, we go to different different religion. Anywhere the wind blows, that's where we go. Right. Christianity, we we, we, we we go there. Islam, we go there. Right. But we never try God's laws. Right. He yeah. give it to us. Give me that if Psalm 147 and 19 real quick. What, what, what did the Lord do to us? He gave his laws to us. But you know how hard-headed we are? We turn our back. We don't listen. That's why now I'm going to show you some things that you got to do now. Because your action counts. Your action counts. You see what I'm saying? Hey, just follow us, okay? Come closer. Read what you got. It's the book of Psalms, chapter 147, verse 19. On. He sheweth his word. He do what? He sheweth his word. He show his word. If you show somebody something, they are seeing it. The Lord showed his words to our forefathers that they should teach it to their children. Come on, come on. He shows his word unto Jacob, uh -huh. his statue and his judgments unto Israel. See, unto Israel, come on. He have not dealt so with any nation. He have not dealt so with any other nation. That's the reason why when we sin, we suffer the consequences. Because he didn't give his laws to anybody. You understand? So now, let me show you something. What is sin? We're about to wrap it up. I want to show you something. What is sin? What is sin? Uh huh. Are you married? No, I'm just asking a question. You know what I mean? Are you married? I see your beard. You're shaving your beard off. Ah, uh, let's see what the Bible says. My brother said he like a bald face. Let's see if God like a bald face too. Let's see. Let's see that real quick. Let's see that real quick. Read that and then we'll have to turn on them. Read that, read that real quick. You hear what he said, right? He said he like a what? A ball fish. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. 21 5, bro. Come on, stay with me. Chapter 21 and verse 5. They shall not make baldness upon their head, neither shall they shave off the corner of their beard. You see what I'm saying? So now, no, 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 no. You see, whenever you shave your stuff, you're not supposed to shave it. That's why bum be coming because you're a lion, bro. A beard is a bash of manly dignity, bro. That's it. The only two people that don't get beard, hey, hey, check this out, bro. The only two people that don't have beard is women and children, bro. That's it. That's it, bro. So now, moving forward, bro, you got to make sure. <laughs> hey, check this out. You know what I mean? You got to make sure moving forward, bro, straight up. This is an opportunity for us as melanated people to come together because they do have a Harley week and then they want to call this Black Bike Week. I didn't know that, but no, I don't figure this is for us. The racism is still here. The racism is still here. It wouldn't be a Harley week and a Black Bike week if it wasn't. Saying? Man, we at Murder Beach for the Black Beach Biker Weekend, whatever it's called, man. The prophets are here to wake our people up, man. To tell our people, man, it's time to repent. 
and come out this foolishness, man. You got this place swarming with our people. You would, you would think we're gathering together with something good, but it's not. It's filth out here. You even got brothers walking around with their wives half naked. What are we doing? We're out here showing our people there's a better way. There's a better example. This image messed us up. Right. And that's why we are here to show you what the real image is. We are something that the most I say.